What's up everybody, it's Sentinel Primic and today I have an update on the low power mode of the iOS 9 beta 1. As you can see it's 100% right now because I'm in the quick time play recording mode and I'm actually the real battery is at 1%. Also, I just want to say that the low power mode right now is not good at all. So let me show you in settings. I have low power mode on and I was able to use 4 hours and a standby time of 13 hours on iOS 8 my usage sorry about that my computer sort of crashed when I was downloading Xcode 7 battery usage on iOS 8 without the low power mode was around 4 to 5 hours tops while the standby time is 21 to 24 hours which is on par with the low power mode on iOS 9. I would not recommend you install this on your primary device even though I did because I was so excited for it but if you really wanted to I suggest that you have an extra battery pack with you at all times. Uh, I was in store yesterday using this device and it got really hot in my pocket but I didn't feel it at first and when I took it out it went from around 50% to 7% and it self rebooted and at that point it only lasted 5 minutes more so battery is not good at all and if you go over here you can have this icon if you tap on it uh, it will show you the details the exact times you used for each app so that's pretty neat and from yesterday or the day before the how I said that the battery widget didn't appear that's because you need to pair a Apple an Apple watch for it to show up so these are pretty cool I would say the low power mode it needs optimization at this point and only stacks up to the original usage time of uh, iOS 8 on the iPhone 5s I hope you guys enjoyed that and thanks for watching